The SU-27 Flanker by Heller, 172nd scale review. Well, it's got a really pretty picture on the front. Artistry job was really excellent. Looks real, looks real specific. Okay, on the front part, I've already opened up the box prior. Well, right now, we get to look at vertical stabilizers. They have engraving and pretty, pretty good surface finesse. We also have air brake, cockpit tub, front wheel with wheel cover, joystick, instrument panel, small parts, ejection seat. And on the other side, we can also see again nice engraving for the vertical stabilizers and some static tubes. Again, the air, air um, speed control and the real basic cockpit tub. We have here a surprise. Also, it's a uh, recommended application for this model. It's the K36 ejection seats. These are a really good addition for this model. It should fit. Detail and scale. Two details. we got a good instruction sheet here. Blown up showing things like the Weapons installation, air to air missiles, landing gear. We also have some more instructions here with cockpit, landing gear, front wheels main landing gear, humbrel numbers for paint, we got the canopy and the windshield, colors, top of the fuselage, jet cans, bottom of the fuselage. Air brake, closed or open. In the main parts. Here we got a really nice top portion of the fuselage with engraved details. Smooth transition from the uh, dorsum of the fuselage to the curves of the engine sights. Some other views of parts for the bottom of the fuselage. Real bare. Oops. Real bare landing gear bay for the front landing gear. Main landing gear, same kind of a thing. Looks like F-14 engine pods. Tail cone. Bottom side of the wings. Here's looking like the uh, wheels for the main landing gear. Afterburner cans. With a little bit of interior detail. 
air scoop parts both sides landing gear struts pitot and angle attack probes other small bits looking some more at the aircraft parts top of the wing from the bottom portion some more engraved detail same here coming along the ventral strakes small wing points for the missile attachments area missiles pretty complete decent detail horizontal stabilizers but again engraved detail landing gear doors with some ribbing detail have also sparse decal Components Blue 66 Stars and some minor stencil information Looks like a good decal set And a couple more pieces here floating around in the Box nose cone and to finish with we have the windshield which is relatively clear but some distortion you can tell And the canopy, cutting it off, I actually made a cut too deep from the tree that it was attached to. You can kind of see on the edge there. And this looks clear, but it's distorted. Recommend a replacement of some kind if they're available. And that's it. Next part will be to build the airplane.